Hey guys, good morning. Um, today is May 13, um, day uh, 59 of quarantine and only 15 more days left in class. So that's pretty cool. I, 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 yeah, it doesn't feel like it, but you know, school's almost over. So we have the rest of this week and two more weeks and technically four days after that, but, um, and then we, remember, we have one day off in May, so uh, at the end of May, so like the last Monday of May, we don't have a school on that day. Um, so, yeah, um, how you guys been doing? Like, I haven't actually been asking that as often as I should, so I wanted to know how you guys are doing. Um, I've been kind of in a rut, like, the last couple of days. Um, I haven't been waking up until, like, 7, 7.30 which for you guys are like, oh my God, that's so early. For me, no, it's not. It's I, I normally wake up around like 5.30, 6, so that I can like work out um, and then have breakfast before I have to wake up my kids. But like, um, it, I've been kind of in a rut the last couple of days. So that for that, since like Sunday, Monday, Monday, since like Monday. So, yeah, it is what it is. Um, but um, I think today, like yesterday, all all we did was watch like YouTube stuff of uh, different kid lunches to like prepare and stuff. It was kind of funny. Um, but I just like stayed on the couch the whole day, and I was like, oh, I I think I'm going to push myself through. Um, I have a couple of meetings today, but. I think I'm going to like force myself to like work out later on today, um, do something. So, you know, whenever you feel down or like depression's hitting, like you should be pushing yourself to try and get out of it or do something to try and get yourself out. So, or at least that's what I try and do. But it normally takes me a couple of days before my brain goes, hey, you should be doing something. So anyways um what are we doing today so we are doing order of operations so if i click on wednesday and i click on the assignments again if you are doing this on your yes if you're doing this on your phone it's kind of tricky you'll have to pay attention to like um the view so remember to zoom out this tells you to zoom out to 50 percent the reason why it's telling you to zoom out for 50% is so that you guys can actually see all the different stuff, like, you know, so that you don't have to be zooming in, zooming out. So when you do it on your phone, it's the same thing. Um, actually, I think I could probably pull it up. Um, So it looks like that. Um, if I turn it sideways, I'll be able to do that. This is uh, one that we did a couple of days ago. But you should be able to, it, I clicked on uh, level zero, and I'm able to do all the work. It's just I need to zoom out to be able to do it. All right. Can you tell what this is? I hope you guys liked it. Some of the, the, the kids that actually did it said that they liked it. So I'm going to continue doing them because it's something different. Like we, we should be doing something different and something fun. So the next few weeks, guys, I'm not going to do anything super crazy. We're going to continue doing equations. Um, I think that's something that you guys really need to know how to do. So um, level one, click on level one. And here are your questions. Again, order of operation, think PEMDAS, parentheses, exponents, so like square, um, uh, multiply and divide depending on, you know, which one's from left to right, and then adding and subtracting again from left to right. So the way that we read. So like, for instance, this one right here. I wouldn't be adding these two guys up first. I would be doing what's inside the parentheses first. So let me grab my trusty pen. 
Um, I want green this time. No, some of you guys can't see green. All right, purple. So 9 minus 2. 9 minus 2 is 7. And then I would should bring everything else out. Nyeh. 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 All right. All right. Then 12, again, left to right, I have an addition. I have a subtraction, so I'm going to do the addition first. So 12 plus 14. Well, I can add the 2 and the 4. 2 plus 4 is 6. 1 plus 1 is 2. And then bring down my 7. Minus 7. I know I'm writing over these things, so whatever. 26 minus 7. 26 minus 7 is 19. So let's see if I got it right. I hit 19. I enter. Oh, look. Oh, I do remember what this one is. So let's do another one for you guys. Um, this one. So... 4 plus 28. We're doing this one first because it's inside the parentheses, so I have to do this part first, plus it's whatever is from left to right because it, I have adding and subtracting. 4 plus 28 is 32. 32 minus 8, 24. So I mean, it's um, oh, sorry. Uh, so 24. 24. And we're going to divide that by 12. So how many times does 12 go into 24? Two times. So I click on 2. Enter. Ooh, more colors. I'm so excited. Uh, let's do a different one. Uh, let's do one with like a, what are these fraction ones? So I'll do six and I'll do seven because then we'll have a fraction and we'll have one with an exponent. So like this one, there's nothing I can do here. So I'm not going to do anything with that guy. But I can do the bottom part. So. Five times three is fifteen minus twelve. Fifteen minus twelve, three. So three goes into eighteen. This one? Six times. Boom. Ha <laughs> ha. So again. We are doing the bottom part because nothing needs to be done to the top. So we're doing the bottom first. So 5 times 3 is 15. Then 15 minus 12 is 3. 3 goes into 18 six times. And then the last one. Um, 4 squared. Again, the square does not mean multiply it by 2. It means you're going to multiply 7 times 7. So this exponent right here tells you how many 7s you have. So I have 7 times 7. 7 times 7 is not, uh, uh, sorry. Actually, PEM does, right? Because I'm not, I'm not thinking PEM does. I have parentheses first. So this is, one, this is one of those cases where it doesn't really matter which one you do first because there's a separation between the two, so nothing's going to change. But we technically should be doing this part first, so let's technically do that. So 6 plus 2 is 8 minus, now I can do this. So 7 squared is 49.
and then 49 minus 8. Oops, wait, that one. Uh, 41. Boom! Do you have an idea of what this is? Oh, I'm so excited. I saw these at, oh, so geeking out. All right, so that should give you guys an idea of how to do this. Again, if, like, say, for instance, I put in, oh, I think this is three, and I hit enter. Apparently, it was three. How about it's uh, six? Uh -huh. So, chances of getting that right. Interesting. So, if I hit enter, and this still stays red, that means you did something wrong. So, red is bad it should turn black. If it doesn't, then go back and try it again because you did the question wrong. This is, this is one of the reasons why I really like this activity because it tells you right away if you got the answers right or wrong. So I really like these because of that reason. So cool. All right. Um, that's it for me. Um, hopefully you guys understand this. Um, if you need anything, please let me know. Um, I do have a couple of meetings around noon. Um, like I said, I'm trying to get out of my little funk, so um, I'm, I might be a little bit on the busy side, but I'm, I mean, I'm always answering your guys' questions. Um, I will keep um, update grades because I had a few people um, submit a bunch of stuff. So, And then also, guys, don't apologize for, oh, this is late. Like, uh, so what? Like, turn it in. Like, I mean, I appreciate the fact that they're like, hey, this is super late. But still, like, you don't you don't have to be constantly telling me like, hey, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Like, I appreciate it. Oh, I have something in my eye. Ugh. So, yeah. All right, guys. Have a good day. Wish you the best. Um, I miss you guys. Please understand that. I, you know, it, it, I think that's one of the reasons that I can't like, you know, this kind of sucks that, you know, and I'm in my little funk that I'm like, well, A, I'm stuck in my house. I mean, I'm going to my mom's, but still like, it's, it's not the same. Um, but I miss you guys, you know, it, it's, it sucks not being able to see you guys. So yeah. All right. <laughs> I'll see you guys later. Take care. Bye-bye.